G'day, my name is Brian from Vision Tech. For the past two weeks, I've been carrying around and also been working on this Dell C1422H. It's a 14 inch portable monitor and it is absolutely a great pairing for those who are working on the laptop, who are also working on the run and away from their usual workspace. Now this will give you either extended display or a mirror mode display as well. Now it's great for the two different functions and I have used them for different reasons and it's absolutely fantastic for meetings or if you're on the go and you need to work on two screens. I found the mirror mode very useful, especially in tight spaces, in, especially in a two person table and you have the computer and this portable monitor back to back and you'll be able to do the presentation and you can actually you still use your touch screen if your laptop has touch screen and also the cursor or trackpad as well. Absolutely fantastic without having to try and do it in an angle. I also found it absolutely fantastic having an extended second display for video editing when I was out and about as I found that the second screen was absolutely great to actually put the extra windows and leaving the main screen for the timeline and the main areas for video editing. The weight of the C1422H portable monitor is 602 grams plus the USB Type-C cable becomes a combined weight of 651 grams that you might be carrying around with you. Measuring the color gamut coverage of the C1422H portable monitor with a rating of 300 nits of brightness or luminance, it resulted with 86.7% sRGB coverage, 59.8% Adobe RGB coverage, and 61.5% DCI-P3 coverage. This is a bit low for working on photos and videos for true colors, but I would be using this portable monitor as an extended display for the toolbars or extra windows that would assist in those photo and video editing softwares. The C1422H monitor is a full HD monitor with a IPS panel. It has an aspect ratio of 16 by 9 and it has a brightness or luminance rating of 300 nits and a matte style finish to the display. Now combining the 300 nits and also the matte when I was trying this working outdoors even in direct summer I didn't have too much issue at all so they're absolutely fantastic having a look at the buttons and ports on the portable monitor on the right hand side we've got a power button and then a USB type C port and on the left hand side we've got a USB type C port as well now both these USB type C ports support power delivery or pass through power now it goes up to a maximum of 65 watts but there is a bit of a catch on the 65 watts that is if your power adapter is more than 65 watts, then it will be able to pass through to the computer 65 watts. Now, if you've got a 65 watt power adapter connected to this portable monitor, then it will only pass through 45 watts to the computer or the device on the other end. And if you've got a 45 watt power adapter, then it only passes through 30 watts. So it uses around about anywhere between 10 to 15 watts to actually power this display. But it's nice still to be able to pass through power. Now there is also another thing about this USB Type-C port. It does not support USB data. So if you plug in a USB flash drive, it will not be recognized by the computer or the device. So you need to connect that directly. So this is only used for pass through power and that's about it for so these USB type C ports. And also on the left hand side, we've got two buttons to adjust the brightness of the display. And then we've got a button called comfort view. Now what the comfort view is, is just pretty much bringing the monitor to a low blue light. If you press it, you will actually see it will go more warmer and you press it again and it pretty much goes back to the normal colors. The Dell portable monitor does come with a sleeve. It's nice to see that Dell have packaged in a sleeve for it and it has a bit of like a felt feel at the outside and inside it more like a suede sort of feel inside. Now, I like to see some improvements in the sleeve. The first thing is maybe having the sleeve either like have a zip or velcro as this doesn't really have anything to hold it in and i like to say probably what i would say is uh maybe a pocket for this cable as it's not really that nicely in there uh, it'd be nice just to give a little bit of a pocket outside for the cable or it's really just hiding underneath is what i found the other thing i found that i like to see is as you can see this thing is a very soft <laughs> now soft is great but 
not in this sort of case when you've got a panel that's kind of exposed and that what I mean by that is once you put this into the sleeve and this goes into your bag this sleeve is really only protecting it from scratches but if there's like hard objects that can actually hit it or bend into it this doesn't really protect it that much so it would be nice if this sleeve is more hard to be able to actually take on some more impact that's inside your backpack or your laptop bag as i fear this could either crack or get damaged the actual panel itself from other objects as this sleeve is not really that great in terms of protection for the display there is a bit of a warning i must give to you now it's not thing to do specifically about this c1422h monitor it's more to deal with portable monitors in general and that's what i found is that especially on older laptops when you have a portable monitor connected to the laptop it will drain the laptop's battery pretty much twice as fast so it's a good idea to look into investing into a laptop portable charger they usually are usb that you'll be able to charge your mobile phone as well so they will charge physically have more power rating to charge laptops but else i have had a fantastic experience on this Dell C1422H portable monitor for when I'm working away from my usual workspace and out and about. This has absolutely been fantastic, giving me more productivity work and absolutely really nice for meetings as well. I definitely have shown this for a number of people and they have all been blown away by this in meetings and the ability to what they could do with that. And there is a few improvements I like to see. First is I like to see a 4K version as well as a touchscreen version of this C1422. And the biggest improvements I like to see is the fact that this sleeve will be a little bit maybe more hard case just to give it more better protection when this is in your backpack or bag just from the panel, that's all. And also it would be nice to actually have that USB-C be able to support USB data as well too. Anyway, I hope you find this informative or enjoyed it. If you did, even support my channel, smash that like button for me. And if you haven't done already, subscribe to my channel by hitting that subscribe button screen. I do try upload a new video every week. And if you want to support me further, there is membership by hitting that join button right next to the subscribe button. And as always, imperfections in life makes it beautiful and interesting. And I'll see you next video.